Welcome to Pice Out of the House. In this video, I'm going to show you how I fit this rental bar brace to my Honda Grom 2015. So this is the Rental Road Brace set which comes in a range of colours. I've chosen gold as it matches my forks and my wheels. To easily fit this into place we first got to loosen off the brake fluid reservoir on the right and the clutch lever on the left. To do this I use an 8mm socket. There are two bolts on each side. I just loosen them off turning anti-clockwise until they come loose. The clutch lever is fine left loose on the handlebars but I need to fully remove the bolts for the brake fluid reservoir in order to gain access to the bolts on the cross brace in a minute. Now I use a 5mm allen key or hex key, I loosen off the bolts on the bar brace ready to fit it into place. Just to note that one side of the clamp is longer than the other so to have them the right way round when we put them back together. So I start to attach the brace first by putting the bolt through the clamp and through the brace and I tighten up by hand loosely. Then place the next bolt through the clamp and around the handlebar. Again, I only do this up loosely to allow me to move it around when I put the other clamp on. I then do the same on the other side. Then using a 5mm allen key or hex key, I tighten up the bolts bit by bit whilst moving the brace into position. Once more or less in position, I come around the front of the bike to take a better look. And once I'm happy the brace looks central and symmetrical, I slowly tighten up the bolts, securing the brace into place. At this point, just be mindful this is made of aluminium and you can strip the threads quite easily, so don't over tighten. If you look on top of the handlebars, you'll find this small depression. To put the clutch lever back where it was previously, I want to line the join of the clamp up with that dot. So I rotate it into position and tighten it up using the 8mm socket. Moving to the other side, check that you have the bracket the right way up. Place your bolts through the bracket and to the opposing side of the bracket on the brake fluid reservoir and tighten up. Again we need to line up the join in the bracket with the dot and then finish tightening up. So there we go, a nice little addition to the standard handlebars and if you have enjoyed this video can you please give it a like and if you haven't done so already can you please subscribe to my channel and press that bell icon for regular notifications. I've been Pouse out of the house. Ta-ta, farewell.